The Queen's Platinum Jubilee is being celebrated with a jam-packed four-day bank holiday this summer. Here are all the bank holiday dates and scheduled events you can expect to see at the Platinum Jubilee. Queen Elizabeth II reached an unprecedented milestone earlier this year when she became the first British monarch to have ever reached seven decades on the throne. In light of her impressively long reign, the nation is pulling out all the stops for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee this summer with a bumper bank holiday weekend. Read on for all the key dates and schedule details. When is the Queen's Platinum Jubilee Bank Holiday? The Queen marked the start of her Platinum Jubilee year on February 6, 2022, the 70th anniversary of her accession following the death of her father, King George VI. But the UK's four-day bank holiday weekend for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee will not run until Thursday, June 2nd to Sunday, June 5, 2022. The usual late May bank holiday has been moved to Thursday, June 2nd, and an additional bank holiday has been granted this year to mark the Queen's milestone, falling on Friday, June 3rd. For a full breakdown of the main events taking place across the Jubilee weekend, see below for the schedule. Thursday, June 2nd. Trooping the color will undoubtedly be the highlight of day one of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee weekend. The Queen's annual birthday parade will see more than 1,400 parading soldiers, 200 horses and 400 musicians go on parade in central London, moving from Buckingham Palace down the Mall to Horse Guards Parade. Members of the royal family are expected to join the spectacle on horseback and in carriages before returning to Buckingham Palace for the annual RAF fly past. The Queen and other royal family members will watch the event from the palace balcony, where they will also wave to the gathered crowds. The event sees extended royal family members gather in addition to the usual working senior royals. More than 1,500 beacons will also be lit on this day across the UK and the Commonwealth to mark the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. The lighting of beacons is a long-running jubilee tradition, and it was a key feature of Queen Victoria's Diamond Jubilee in 1897. Friday, June 3rd. A service of thanksgiving for the Queen's long reign will be held on Friday, June 3rd at St Paul's Cathedral in London. The service will not be open to the public. Saturday, June 4th. The Derby at Epsom Downs will take place on Saturday, June 4th, and it is expected that the Queen and other royal family members will attend. The Queen is famed for her love of horses and racing, so this will undoubtedly be a highlight of the Platinum Jubilee weekend for the monarch. Later on Saturday, the Platinum Party at the Palace will be staged and broadcast live by the BBC. The concert will take place live at Buckingham Palace and has been billed to include performances from several of the world's biggest stars. Sunday, June 5. People across the UK are invited to share friendship, food and fun with neighbours during the Big Jubilee lunch on Sunday, June 5. Communities across the nation are being urged to share a picnic, barbecue or tea and cake session to mark the final day of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. The Platinum Jubilee pageant is also being held on the Sunday, and it promises to tell the story of the Queen's 70-year reign in an awe-inspiring festival of creativity. The event will see dancers, artists, musicians, military personnel, key workers and volunteers take part in a visual spectacular. Pageant master Adrian Evans told The Telegraph he hoped to create exuberance, excitement, spectacle and wow factor. He added, we won't see the likes of this again. We want it to be absolutely awesome for everyone, and particularly for Her Majesty the Queen. We want her to feel we have done her proud.